students, I'm going to show you how to make a nice uh, part on Autodesk using an image that I refer to as pixel art. So any kind of picture that's made up of these nice uh, uh, symmetrical squares, I like to say that each square is one inch by one inch. So you can take any pixel art image and using these techniques that I'm about ready to show you, you can turn it into a nice uh, 3D object. So that's a little sneak peek of what we are trying to do. We want to create that shape. I'm going to close this. We're going to go into part. We're going to say start 2D sketch. Click on the XY plane. And if we look at our picture, I'm going to draw a 16 inch by 16 inch square. So I'm going to use two point center, click, drag, let go, type 16, hit tab, 16, enter. There's my square, finish sketch, extrude it. I just want to extrude it one inch. Now what we are going to do is make some cut extrudes. So we're going to do subtractive extrudes to get the correct form. Simply going to say start 2D sketch and I'm going to draw on this surface here. I'm going to use a two point rectangle this time. I'm going to make this half screen. Drag it till your arrow hits the edge of the screen. have this open over here. What I'm trying to do is cut out these white boxes so I get this shape. So using my my two-point rectangle I'm gonna click in the corner go over five and down one because I have five boxes one two three four five Then I'm gonna come over here and go over three and down one over two and down one. And I'm going to go over one but down two. So one tab, two, enter. Now down here at the bottom, I go over four and up one. So four, tab, one, enter. The next one is three, tab, one, enter. And I've got a little box of uh, squares, so two tab 2, enter, and then uh, one square all by itself. So 1, tab 1, enter. I'm going to make this full screen now. I'm going to draw a line down the middle because the object I'm trying to create is the same on both sides. So I'm going to draw a center line right down the middle of this object. Right click, say OK, because you just need one line. Then you're going to use this mirror function. So select what you want to copy. So I want to copy all those rectangles I drew. And then I want to mirror them across this line. Click apply. And it takes everything from the left side and it puts it on the right side. Now if I finish sketch, I can do my subtractive extrudes or my cut extrudes. So I'm going to change this from join and I'm going to change it to cut. And then all I need to do is click. Teachers and students, pardon the interruption. This is Mr. Rich, and I do have an important update regarding today's activities. So um, if everyone could listen up carefully. Obviously, the weather outside has decided not to completely cooperate with us today. So Voila. Did that during an announcement. Uh, Pretty impressive. Our right? For the day, but we're going to have to make some adjustments to our plan. And so teachers, I just sent an all-NEMS